Hey guys, it's Rain. So today I want to share this phone case idea inspired by the pink pig mirror from the Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star collection. I love them both and hopefully I don't get in any trouble by doing this. For this, I'm going to be using this really old phone case. It's really stained, as you can see, it's kind of like yellowish, but we're going to be painting this anyways. I'm going to be using this pink and white acrylic paint and my brush, creating a lighter shade of pink, covering the whole phone case, giving this a few coats until it's opaque enough. And this is how I'm letting the whole thing dry. Once it's done and dry, I'm going to be making a template. I'm going to be placing my phone case on top of a piece of paper, and I'm just going to trace the shape of it. And so this is going to be like my template, and I'm just going to be working on the shape of like or the face rather of the pig and I just searched online for like the mirror for this I base myself pretty much from like Jeffree Star's website from uh, the shop section and then like the mirror itself I was a copycat for this one <laughs> but yeah I'm just going to be cutting that then I'm going to be poking a lot of holes all throughout the uh, template itself like this following all the uh, like traces I did with my pencil and then once that's done I'm just going to be marking all the tiny holes all over the place. I'm pretty sure this technique that I'm doing right here has a name, I just don't remember it or just I don't know it. I'm pretty sure you have done this, but yeah, I'm just doing that, tracing the shape of the face. So then when you remove it, it's kind of like uh, hard to tell because you just have uh, like a bunch of like dots all over the place, but you pretty much have to connect the dots. This is pretty much what this is all about. But then once the whole shape is done, I'm just gonna go back to the pink acrylic paint without any white this time and this setting tool. I do you have the DIY for the studying tool it's pretty handy I just prefer to work with this one because I can clean it after and it's thinner so not a lot of like paint gathers around it but yeah I'm just going to be covering with paint all like the marks of like my pencil everything that I drew And finally, I'm just going to be adding some like gloss. I'm using this uh, Sculpey glaze gloss and I cover uh, this phone case with this gloss because it uh, brings the whole thing together plus it uh, protects the sign. But yeah guys, this is pretty much what this one looks like. Hopefully this doesn't get me in any trouble, but I really feel inspired by uh, Shane Dasson and Jeffree Star. I think they're both amazing people. I love the series. I think it's pretty interesting to see like the business side of like things. Jeffree Star, as a business owner, pretty successful and creative, and I really like Shane's Dawson like perspective on things. He's really interesting, and his reactions they're pretty like honest and relatable. I love the series. I wish they would never end. I think the collection looks amazing, which, as I understand, it's sold out in like half an hour, which is shocking beyond me. Which goes to show how amazing both are and why we love them. I wish Jeffrey Star was my manager, and as you can tell, I'm obsessed with the pink pink mirror. I think it's really cute, and I wanted to uh, try it on my phone case it doesn't look as cute and as perfect as this one is hand painted but i still uh, love it but yeah hopefully you like this one if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more phone cases that i have on my channel and subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and share this but yeah thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye